Um, hey everybody, what is going on? I'm making a short little video here. I pretty much bought all the flashes and lasers in the game. I'm just going to do a small little comparison. Um, these ones are fla uh, lasers that you can put on actual big weapons. Um, you can put the pistol ones on them too, but you can't put these ones on pistols, but you can put the other ones on. So this is just, uh, again, like a small little comparison. I'm just going to go through each one really quick. And I have to put each one manually if I just drag it on the gun. Well, this one actually puts it correctly, but the other ones, if I drag them on the gun, it puts it on the top. Uh, so uh, let's just go ahead and go through each one. The first one, I'll, and I'll go quickly, is the 2U Klech Tactical Flashlight. And if we give it a test, it's just uh, straight up a flash. I'm going to step back a little bit. There's no other positions to it. That is it. Um, for the second one that we're going to try out is the LS321. This one is my favorite. Um, put it on, try it. So um, it starts off, you have a green laser. Uh, you can kind of see it. I know it's a little bit dark and that's the whole point here because you'd be using the lasers sort to help you guide and you can kind of see how they are. So they have uh, a green one, a red one, which is a little weaker. Then it has a low red light. Uh, to help you look in dark spot then you have a low red light with a laser and then we are back to the green one all right take it off uh the next one is the la5 and oh i'm not supposed to drag it like that and then for this one um we start off with a red laser then we have another red laser then we have the low light, low light with red laser. So I think the the first laser is a little bit stronger than the second one. Um, barely, barely noticeable. And I don't know if anybody uses that low red light. And that's what we have for the LA-5. Then we're going to switch over to the ANPEQ-15. Um, goes right here. And then this one we have a red light. I mean red light, a uh, red laser, another red laser. Then we have a low red light, low red light with laser. So I think it's the same thing where you have the red laser and then the second one is just a little bit weaker. Uh, very similar to the LAQ. And then we're going to go for the Zenit Purst 3. And I have to put it here. All right, this one we have a red laser. Then we have another red laser. Low red light, low red light with laser. So pretty much the same deal. Um, I don't think there's supposed to be a difference between them. Maybe just the way they look. But um, that's been the lasers for the ones that you can put on guns. Now, these other ones, you can also put it on guns. Um, but I specifically bought them to use them on pistols. So this is one that I was very excited about, the tactical blue laser. Um, so get ready to be disappointed I don't, I don't know if I'm, I'm trying to get close to the box i don't know if you guys can tell it it's so i don't know if it's supposed to be used with night vision but it's so weak i was so excited i thought this was going to be so cool but um yeah that's not the case and um by the way that's it it's got no other it's got no other options you can just, yeah just on and off is basically the only thing it has it's kind of disappointed in that one um, then we'll go with the LS TAC 2. This is a pretty, pretty popular one. So turn it on, we have a flash. Then we have, I believe, a flash and a laser. No, this is just a flash, sorry. Yeah. So this is just a, this is just a straight up flash. Nothing else. I thought it also has, let me see. Tact, okay. So I saw the last slash text. I thought it has like laser, but it doesn't. Then we have the uh, Surefire XC1 Tactical LED Flashlight. So I think this is, again, just a flash. Yep, no different positions. Uh, take this one off. Then we're going to go with the Glock GL21 Flashlight Wood Laser. Uh, we have a flash. Then we have a flash with a laser. And then we have just a, a red laser. Um, pretty similar to... A lot of them. This one, uh, it says Glock on it, but you can use it on a, a whole bunch of other pistols. 
um, clutch flashlight the two IRS. So starting off, we have a flashlight, flashlight with laser, and then the laser. So pretty much the same as the Glock. I personally don't see any difference, just three positions. I don't see much difference uh, between them. They're they're pretty similar, like especially these two. X400, probably one of the more popular ones because you find it everywhere. You have a flashlight, flashlight with laser, and then you have the laser. Again, for me, I'm not noticing any difference between them. So this one again just has three positions. Then we're going to go for the 2P clutch flashlight and laser. Try it out. We have a flashlight, flashlight and laser, and then just the laser. Um, again, I, I, I don't know if there's actually any stats difference between them. If there is, it's not noticeable for me. And then we have the stain, uh, st stainer, whatever, the PL tactical. This one's kind of pricey. And we have a flashlight. Then we have, ooh, we have a green laser. Then we have a flashlight with green laser. Then we have a low red light. Then we have a low red light with a low laser. Oh, sorry, the, the red laser and then the low red light with the laser. And then back to the flashlight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven no six that was that was back to it so it has six different positions uh red laser is i don't know not that strong the the green the green laser looks pretty good um and that is pretty much it now the last thing that i do want to show you guys is the um the hs uh the hs 401 g5 and the reason why i want to show you guys is because this one has a, a built-in laser and Especially on a, especially on a hunter. Can I switch my weapons? Yeah, there we go. Especially on a hunter, um, like the laser is not that. Great. I mean, the the scope is not that great, but you can turn the laser on. And especially if you're moving and going close quarters, I mean, this this will help you be pretty accurate ish. You know, with the with the laser. And I, and I started using this one recently. So I don't know. Some people don't know about it. That I would maybe share with you guys. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. God bless you all beautiful faces. Hugs and kisses. And I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.